Hello, I am Test Drive, and welcome to more Need for Speed Shift on the PC. And in this video, oh lord, it is time to do a drift competition. Oh no. I guess we'll get our little introduction to this, and then I will try to figure out what kind of car I want to use for it. Uh, but let's get into this. Our first shot at the drift events, you're being judged not only on spe or for speed, but also style. Reduce the handbrake, keep your speed, and get as close as possible to the cones. I don't remember anything about how the drifting works in this game. We're gonna find out! Alright, so... Uh, yeah, we just have four different drift events. Who is Hazy View? Who? I don't know why I said who. What is Hazy View? Um, so what are, what are the restrictions here? Ah! So I need to use the 370Z. Oh, do I get to use preset cars? I think I do, actually, so I don't actually have to worry about cars. Interesting. Okay, well, uh, yeah, I guess we'll get started then. Uh, so Hazy View is our first track. Hazy View 8. Um, drift Time is a star. I don't know what that means specifically. Maybe how long you're drifting for. 15,000 for winning and got to use the 370Z. Okay. Drifting is the art of maintaining the edge of control. Use the handbrake to kick off the drift, then feather the throttle and brake to maximize it. It's a combination of speed, angle, and distance. It's a battle of three rounds. The winner will have the best combined total of all three. All right, okay, so get as many points as possible. Okay, uh, this looks stock as hell. I think this is completely stock, except for the paint job, of course. Uh, yeah. Let's see how this goes. Accelerate, pull away steadily, and don't accelerate too hard in the straights or you'll spin out. Turn our corners too fast. Tap the brakes. About to start. All right, score right, to beat is 582. Right, here we go. Okay. I'm gonna fucking suck at this, probably. Let's find out. I don't... I feel like for some reason this isn't going to be like, uh, Pro Street's drifting. Yes, I know, I'm... <laughs> There's three rounds. I don't know how good that was, or bad. Uh, well, apparently I smashed everybody else and got a lot more points than all of them. Oh, it actually tells me what car they're in, too. Interesting. Okay, we'll continue on. Uh, score to beat now is 1,076, so I guess it just keeps going up each round. Okay, and I still have to do a four-second drift. Um, now, do I have to... Okay, I do have to restart my points. Nice smoke, nice speed. Oh, there's a thousand points. Oh, careful. I gotta get that four second drift. Ow. Oh, that wasn't even a four second drift. It might have been actually. I think it might have popped up at the last second there. I just finished the race before it actually got time. Well, uh... There we go. I'm still ahead by 300 points, exactly. All right, let's move on to the last round here real quick. Score beat 1667. I haven't even been focusing on that. I've been focusing on trying to get the stars. Oh my God, there's a girl. Oh. No, I have not done the four second drift yet. Okay, 
So I need to focus on that this round for sure. I think... There we go. I got it. Well, so far this is actually pretty easy. This is like the easiest part of the game. Maybe because I'm on medium difficulty? I don't know. But I feel like I can actually control the drifts a little bit too, which is cool. Oh, I won. We not a we not a chicken dinner. All right, there we go. Seventeen hundred ninety-nine points overall, beating out Dale somebody, Dale Bennett, and all these other people. Cool. All right. I'm going to have to mute this because the music's still playing. Yay! Got all my stars. Got 15 grand. We'll just let this play out real quick. You can listen to the sweet sounds of my voice while... I don't know what song this is, but it's actually a pretty good song in the background. It's kind of like an indie rock song of sorts. And I also hit level 14. Did I do that this race? No. I don't think so, no. Okay, now we're back to normal end race music. Okay, we continue. First event was a smashing success. Let's go. Six out of six stars. Starting off strong. All right, Drift at Spa up next. Oh boy, is that an S15? That is an S15. All right, uh, Drift time once again. I gotta drift some of the corners at Spa. Okay, let's go. Okay, we'll be drifting the Nissan Silvia S15 in today's competition. Boogie. There is an S15 spec R. All right, let's go. I was really worried about this set of events, honestly. I didn't know what to expect. About to start. Right, this is all about speed, angle, and hitting those clipping points. Back when I played right, Pro Street, there were some, uh, some, some, uh, questionable drifting experiences with that game. But this one so far? Well, I guess we'll see, though. I've only done one. Used one car. Alright, I got most of the points I need. Well, over half. Well, yeah. Now I can do this and get the four second drift, hopefully. Yeah, let me cook! 500 profile points. Well, um, I didn't beat anybody yet. Well, I beat somebody, probably. Uh, I was kind of focusing on that four seconds of drifting. I'm not too far behind, so we should be fine. Okay, next. 1141. Gotta basically double my, my score. Bram, bram, bram. Oh, I like that the uh, the boost gauge is actually like the real boost gauge in the car. That's cool, actually. I didn't even notice that the first round. <laughs> okay, so uh, do a bit drift around here. Keep going too far to the inside. You can still drift down the straights too, so it's like Pro Street. I think Pro Street you could do that. Oh shit. Well, that's not good. Can I restart this round? All race progress to be lost. Okay, yes, I can. Don't mind me, it's fine. Oh god. I'm already off balance. So this isn't particularly easy, I'm not gonna lie, but it's not difficult either. It takes a, a bit of a, a bit of a being careful for sure to hit what you need. All right, I'm not too far behind. I can come back in the third round. I'm like 100 points, not even 100 points back. 
1070 versus 1141. Okay. I can come back from that. It's an E36 in front. Ooh. <clears throat> Alright, Dale, bring it on. We aren't doing it for Dale today, gamers. We're doing it against Dale. <laughs> Different Dale, though. I would never go against our Lord and Savior, Dale Earnhardt Sr. It's 1764, excuse me? Oh, that was unfortunate. <laughs> Alright, I have to do good at this... Uh, the sweeper down here. You can call this a sweeper. It's kind of a tighter sweeper, but I think it's still a sweeper nonetheless. Okay. Oh, I got it. I didn't even crash that time. I actually got it by a lot. I was... I don't know how I got so many points there at the very end. I feel like it jumped up by like a hundred, like, instantaneously. But there we go. Another drift event down. I have no idea how hard these would be on hard difficulty. I don't think we're going to find out today. Don't worry about it. Alright. It'll give me some good points too. So I'll be able to uh, get closer to leveling up. I don't know if I'll actually level up in this video. Since I've already done... This is halfway actually, isn't it? Because there's four total events. 24 stars total. Okay. Next. Alright, we got a drift at Silverstone up next. With the Mazark 7. Once again, have to get drift time. Oh, it's going around. Oh, dear lord. So we're going around the uh, the final set of corners. Minus a little, like, kink in the road. Before you hit the, the finish line. Okay, they're 15k. I'll take okay, it. Okay, we're running the Mazda RX-7 in today's drift competition. Thanks for letting me know, bud. Much appreciated. Okay, I've already driven this car. Not a drift event, though. I raced it against a Z4 M Coupe. About to start. Right, this is all about speed, angle, and hitting those clipping points. I guess. Right, here we go. Pop-up headlights don't actually work in this game. I think they're always popped up no matter what, which is unfortunate, honestly. All right, let's go. Oh, this is very... event-themed here at Silverstone. Oh, 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 I've already gotten a star. Wait, I've already beaten the score and I'm not even around this corner yet. That's funny. Easy clap. Like, actual easy clap. I basically doubled the next best score. Almost. Almost did. Okay. Next round. What do we got? 584? I'm almost there already. What am I at? Like, 541 or something? Five forty six. I have to get... 38 points. I can do that. I might be cooking on these drift events, to be honest with you. They might be letting me cook. Besides, when I do stuff like that, it's fine. I'm not being actually judged like it's a real drifting competition. Oh, there's all my stars. And uh, I might have enough points to win this already with 1225 after round two. Why is Silverstone being nice to me for once? Usually it's mean to me. <laughs> yeah, I'm literally over double second place. All right, let's see if I've already won. <laughs> I did already win. I have to beat myself apparently. That's so funny. We're chilling. For this last round. I wonder what the next best score is going to be. I guess I can use this to get more points. Just to level up quicker. I don't know.
Oh, oh, let me cook. Oh, hold on. I'm about to cook right into a tire wall. It's fine. The drifting, not too bad in this game so far. I'm gonna be honest with you. Can I go on the outside of this and still win? I can. <laughs> Very funny. The car is a little sad, but it's fine. Ah, I was still 400 points ahead of second place at the end there. Or at, at the beginning of that round. And now I'm 1,100 points. Almost 1,200. Oh, you know what? I appreciate this. This is a nice change of pace. From everything being mad at me and wanting to kill me. Normally in this game. I have one more to go, but I'm sure it'll be fine. How many stars is this game I'm gonna be up to in this game whenever we're done? Kind of like wondering, uh, wondering how many points I was going to be at at the end of Test Drive Limited on PS2. I don't know. Well, we're gonna be up to 167 with these. Um, all right, Drift at London, final event in the M3. E that's not an E36. That's an S15. Uh, yeah, M3 E36, drift time once again. What in the world is that path? What the hell? All right. Okay, BMW is lending us the M3 E36 mm -hmm. for today's drift event. Bunga Bunga E36. It's like a Euro European spec with 282 horsepower, not a uh, American spec. Although, slightly mad is British, so maybe that's why. Okay, Which is funny because all the cars are left in drive. Except for R34, probably. Here we go. Who has wins? What? Who are we talking about? Dale? Are we doing it for Dale again? Alright, four second drift again. I'm finally driving a car without a turbo. Well, I guess the 370Z didn't have a turbo. Come on, give me the start. Thank you. Much appreciated. Oh, I see how this goes. Okay. Went by at least a little. I actually don't know how much I went by. There's still a little bit left. I'm gonna win by a lot. That's the answer. 956 to 673. All right, well done. <laughs> Good wall placement. I like it. Oh, my car is damaged. That's fucked up. All right. Dale even here? Where's Dale at? Oh, Dale's in last. That's fucked. All right. Where to beat is now 1280. Let's see if I can get. Uh, an automatic first place. I saw shiny pants. Shiny pants are good. Let me be honest with you. Maybe I'm wearing shiny pants. Nobody would ever know, though, because you don't see my pants. So you just have to believe what I say. Got my thousand points, so we are kind of cooking. Ooh. Oh, oh, I never stopped to drift there. Ah, oh, geez. We're fine. Everything's fine. Just a tap. Just a wall tap. All right, let's see. Up to 1,700, 1,800. Oh, that's a wall. Now nah, you know. All right, will 1843 win me the entire event? It might. There is a chance. Oh, my car is a little sad. Just a little. Alright. One more round. It's three G35s in second, third, and fourth. Nice. Um, no, not quite. I will need a few more points to win. Like a hundred? Uh, 144 points to win. Gee, I wonder if I'll be able to get that. 
as I've been over here getting 900 points per round. Yeah, I wonder if I'll get that. Alright, drifting in this game? Easy clap, like, actually. I'm almost double. <laughs> Over 3,000 points, good lord. And, oh, it was almost, wait, can I? Oh, I can't really drift that much anymore. Oh. My ears, stop! <laughs> Please. I might have to edit that in post to make it not blow out everybody's ears as they're watching this, because this game is fucking loud. But there we go. There's our first set of drift, uh, drift events done. Absolutely clap those cheeks. They didn't stand a chance. 60,000 points. Over 60,000 points. By a decent amount. I like that aggressive is nice smoke and what is the other one? Like why, why is that aggressive? Why is smoke aggressive in a drifting event? Like that's just how it works. You drift and there is smoke from the tires. The P doesn't work on their, their ride over there. Star Collector. Yay. Time to go back. How do I have two losses now? When did I lose again? Oh, was it when I was doing one of the uh, the special objectives previously? Maybe. Well, there we go. Another four events down. All the stars gathered. 167 overall. We're cooking. We're cooking our way through here. So we have three of these done, four left to go, it looks like. Um, oh dear. I don't know what to expect from these. The next series might take a bit. Uh, just gonna throw it out there. The game got louder because my audio glitched out. Not for you, at least. Uh, but there we go. That will conclude yet another episode of Need for Speed Shift. Nice chill one this time around. We're almost level 15, which is cool. We'll probably be there. I mean, we're going to be there in the next video, for sure. Um, but, yeah, there's all the, the main badges I got. Oh, I have, uh, oh no, I don't have one of each, damn. Oh, there is actually, uh, things for mastering all the corners. Interesting. Does it want me to finish on hard? Yeah. I could probably do this. We'll see. We'll see if I actually end up doing those or not. Crafting... Yay. Well, anyways, I hope you all enjoyed this video, and I suppose I will see you all in the next one.